What's up, Microfiles? Here is another Patreon repost for you guys. If you are new here, please go subscribe to my main channel, Mycophilia. You won't regret it. And if you would like to see fruiting videos like this one month ahead of everybody else, consider subscribing to my Patreon. A one-week trial is now available, along with dozens of educational fruiting videos. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Is up, everybody? This is Michael File Sage checking in here today. Just wanted to make a quick video with, for you guys. So I'm harvesting my Shakti tub here. As we see, we have a bunch of fruits right over there, and we got a little bit left. Now these fruits over here are rather small, as you can see. Their caps aren't open or anything. So is a lot of fruits over here. I mean, this is even a bigger one, and the caps barely open, right? Um, there's actually really only one fruit that I found that uh, seems good for swabs. I can try to force swab these, but I'm just worried because I feel like I'm gonna get some, uh, you know, bacteria and stuff because I might be touching the stems and such rather than just the, inside the gills. It'll be a tough job. But as you can see, there's a lot of closed fruits. Um, most of them are closed basically, except one, which is really, really open. Nice big caps. I'm going to be doing a clone of this and swabs. The reason I'm telling you guys all this is because the purpose of this video is that I want to basically discuss like when to harvest mutants like this. Because this is a question that we see all the time. I'm sure many of you guys have seen it. When do I harvest this PE? When do I harvest this ghost? You know, that kind of thing. Um, so that's what I want to touch up on today. Um, so essentially these guys have basically looked like this for quite a while right and maybe like two or three days ago they started turning blue as you can see and after a while they stopped turning blue but they really haven't grown like for a couple of days um nor have they really become any more blue maybe like to a certain point but after like a while they didn't turn any more blue but the main thing that you need to keep out for watch out for is basically just slightly touch it touch the fruits right and if they're firm which they will be they, that means that they are not ready for harvest. When they are ready for harvest, they will become really, really soft. So with these guys, don't go by whether the veils are opening or the color because they will change color and they might still be growing, uh, you know, with these mutants. Um, for example, as I said, these guys are small, right? But the thing is, these guys are ripe and ready for harvest. And I'll show you guys here. They should be like marshmallows. They are a lot, they're quite soft and there's quite a lot of give. You see how easily they move? When, when they're not ready, then it's gonna be firm. It's gonna be much firmer, but these guys are very soft. Some softer than others, but in general, these guys are ready for harvest because it, they are at least starting to turn soft, which means that they've basically stopped growing and they're good to go. Um, so I guess in short, a little recap, um, don't go by color. Don't go by how the gills are. These guys are mutants. A lot of times they don't open gills until they're, they're gonna be ready for harvest anyways. And the third thing, the most important thing is go by feel. Go by feel. Uh, this is pretty much practically a foolproof way. Just touch it if it's, you know, at first to familiarize yourself with it. When you first start getting fruits, just touch a little bit so you understand like when you shouldn't harvest. So basically they'll feel firm. So now you know, okay, so it's not ready. Um, and when they are ready for harvest, then they will become significantly softer. Like, look at how, you know, nice and soft these guys are. So yeah, that's basically it. They'll be ready for harvest and nice and easy. So let's just harvest one of these guys right here. Very nice, like marshmallow, super easy to harvest. And um, yeah, so, you know, this is the first time I've grown Shakti and I'm sort of surprised that uh, um, for a mutant, it's not bluing much at all right? Like I, I thought it would turn a lot more blue, sort of like the tap black caps that I had, you know, but uh, those are basically more potent. So just because a, a, spe a, a variety is a mutant doesn't exactly mean that it's going to be, you know, to the level of PE, for example, or apes in terms of potency. But these guys in general, mutants are still more potent than regular cubes on average. Uh, they are quite a bit more potent, but um, not as much as the, you know, PEs and stuff like that. So yeah, that's uh, basically the video for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a great day and night.